Tonight, the attorney representing the Arlington nun accused of breaking her vow of chastity is speaking to CBS News Texas. We're told the Bishop of the Catholic Diocese of Fort Worth now being accused of defamation and the Carmelite nuns are apparently not backing down. Our Olivia Leach has the very latest. Back in April, the Bishop of Fort Worth, Michael Olson, accused Arlington nun Reverend Mother Superior Teresa Agnes Gerlach of violating her vow of chastity with a still unnamed priest from outside the Catholic Diocese of Fort Worth. Her attorney has denied that allegation and the Reverend Mother is now suing the bishop. Absolutely nothing in this process has been fair or done correctly. I mean, from the very beginning, how this started, procedurally, the way the bishop has gone about this has been absolutely contrary to very established uh, canonical rules in the canonical process. The diocese says the Vatican gave the bishop the authority to represent the pope. Bishop Olson conducted an investigation and concluded on Thursday that the Reverend Mother was guilty of violating her vow of chastity and dismissed the Reverend Mother from the monastery. You know, what was interesting about this latest, uh, his latest decree dismissing her from the order, uh, to this day, we still don't even know what the allegation is. In a scathing letter sent to Bishop Olson on Saturday, the Reverend Mother's attorney, Matthew Bobo, calls on Bishop Olson to offer proof or evidence to back up his claim that the nun violated her vow of chastity, writing, quote, Your Excellency, you have repeatedly and publicly accused the Reverend Mother Superior Teresa Agnes Gerlach of violating her vow of chastity with a priest. What is the specific allegation you have found the Reverend Mother guilty of? If he had the proof, if he had something so damning that it would warrant what he's done, you would think it would be pretty simple to put it out there and go, Listen, she deserves this. Now her attorney is accusing the bishop of defamation. He says the Reverend Mother will remain at her monastery in Arlington as she appeals the decision and that the Carmelite nuns are not backing down. Olivia Leach, CBS News, Texas. Olivia, thank you. Now we reached out to the Catholic Diocese of Fort Worth for comment, but we did not hear back. The diocese says it will reinstate mass at the monastery this Wednesday. A civil court hearing is scheduled for later this month.